to the best family on YouTube. Rock. Well, good morning, everyone. I guess not good morning, but you know, we're starting the video off a little bit late today. It's it's about to be one here, so good afternoon, everyone. Heading to work right now. Hope you guys enjoyed yesterday's video, of course. Yesterday's video was an interesting one. I didn't expect for the whole shield stuff to happen. It just happened, I guess. I'm glad, though, because it saved the video. I don't think the video would have been that long if uh, if I didn't do the shield stuff. Shout out to Shields for saving the video once again. Oh, yeah, actually, with the fishes and stuff, I'm gonna put their little toys this afternoon, so they won't be toyless. I'll have all that stuff ready for them this afternoon and um, I'm feeling good about this one alright I'm feeling good about this run because I got the bacteria in there I did everything according to you know what it should be hopefully everything goes well but besides that I don't really know what else to do today just gonna be doing the normal stuff I actually do want to finish up orientation for modeling that's that's something that I want to do for the next four days I don't have work so yeah. My tea's gone cold, I'm wondering why And I can see it all It reminds me that it's not so bad It's not so bad at all Hey, hey, I got a gun am I? If you want it, girl, come and get it All this is here for you Take me to church, I worship like a dog At the shrine of your lies I'll tell you my sin so you can shop me a knife Oh, for me, that deathless death and good God, let me give you my life. Boys, boys, boys. Okay, so, see, this is what happens when I, like, wash my hair and everything. If I don't mention that I wash my hair, it's pretty easy to tell because the hair becomes, a, it looks like a Fortnite bush. But yeah, uh, we're at work right now. I'm about to be done here really soon. I'm just waiting on one person to drop off their dog so I can, you know, put them in a kennel, all that kind of stuff. So it's a pretty easy day today. I don't know what to do today, but that'll be something that we figure out as time goes on. Uh, actually, what I wanted to mention to you guys is, hey, we're almost at 2.98k subscribers, so... We're 20 subs away from 3,000. Please run it up, all right? Run it up. We're getting there. Subs is not something I talk about all the time, but, you know, if you guys could, help me out a little bit. Either way, um, I'm hungry. I'm addicted to Chinese restaurants. What's it to ya? Yeah? Big bag. Big I'm a bit of a big bag, all right? My, my, my bad. This isn't even a well, well, well moment because I'm a Filipino, so... Uh, ouch. I'm hungry, so I'm gonna go in and eat some Chinese again. I, I was literally here like a few days ago. Shut up. All right, I'm gonna go grab my first plate real quick. All right, I guess this is technically like a like a Chinese buffet review. I would start off with my favorite one, the China King buffet, but I, honestly, I was I really wanted the the crab legs, so that's what I'm actually gonna get. All right, be right back. Big bag. How are you today? Good. I'm doing good. How about you? Good, good. Good. Yeah. He gave me another straw. He must have a crush on me. I got peanut butter chicken, which is like my favorite, like chicken, like from Chinese. I also got some crab, got some crawfish. Big back, big. I swear to God, if editor actually puts big back on every single bite that I take, I'm gonna be peed on. There will be hell to pay. Back, yeah, my. Hi boys, it's crawfish time. So the thing is about these, obviously it's a mini lobster, pretty much. You get the tail and everything, but the thing is with these, it's like that's the only thing you can really get out of it is the tail. Right after 30 seconds of digging in there, this is all I got. A little meat. Yes, yeah, sir. Wait, before we keep pushing, the peanut butter chicken, it's just as good as the one from China Kick. 10 out of 10. The rice, it serves its purpose. 7 out of 10. The crawfish, spicy. 8 out of 10. The little clams, 7 out of 10. Now the main course, wraps. If it wasn't obvious enough, I come here pretty often. And I've had these, you know, I've had these crab legs and they're good. But the thing is, right, the only like downside to these, and I think like they could improve on, is uh, flavoring the, the, the crabs, you know what I mean? Add a little bit of like spices in the water. Like where I got this from, it's pretty much just a pot of boiling water, you know? So I think maybe a little extra flavor would definitely uh, bump this up higher. This is a solid eight out of 10 though. What a moron. Load it up with snack. All right, round two. I got jalapeno chicken. It's the same thing from last time. It's just I just added the jalapeno chicken, so. Double the shit. It's really good. Hot pepper chicken is something that China King Buffet has too. And I think that China King Buffet is the best one here. When should I compare this hot pepper chicken to what uh, China King has? If it's good. It's about the same. Bro, I'm not even Right. As I'm eating my ice cream here, got dessert and stuff. I, I'm full. I'm full. I'm not even gonna lie to you. Just gonna finish up with this ice cream and also talk about the price. I don't normally look at how much it costs. Not because I'm rich or anything, but there's just some restaurants where it's like I know that they're not gonna be expensive. And plus, like I don't really care because it's like the food's good, right? What are we looking at? 
2170. Not sure if they have it here, but what I do like about um China Kung Fu, Ch no. what I do like about China Kung Fu is that they have like this like 10 day pass thing. You get a discount for like a big package for 10 times to come here. You save a little bit of money and stuff. So I wish they have it here too. I don't know if they do, but if they do, W. It's about to be 8 o'clock and it's still 91 degrees. Here's a kid right here. And I think he saw me walk by with the ice cream. Because now he's yelling at his parents being like, Mama, please, ice cream. Well, ladies and gentlemen, shout out to shout out to Super Buffet for being pretty good. Decent price, too. That's what matters, you know what I mean? It's like a bang for your buck. It's a good price and it's good. That's all that matters. Done being a big back now. Task time, task time. So what I gotta do now? All right, I was doing some research on small koi fish aquariums or tanks or whatever. And what I found out is that they don't really have like a little household for them. Uh, for the most part that I've seen. They just kind of have like plants everywhere and stuff and, they, and they, they, don't, they don't have like a cave or whatever. So we're gonna run this up here. This is one of the plants. We're gonna, we're gonna put it in and put it in we shall. I'm gonna buy some more plants here eventually. Oh, there we go. Sorry fishies, don't mean to scare you guys. Just putting in some, some habitats, you know what I mean? It's not too deep, it's not too deep. Okay, perfect. All right, so for the people who have troubles with uh, with focusing, here's some fishies for you to watch while I'm gonna be talking. It's been a while since I've been over at the house and uh, it's been about like almost, no, it's been over two weeks and yeah, I haven't really stayed over at the place except when I pick up my mom for work or something, but that doesn't really count, you know what I mean? So I figured I stop by, say hi, and uh, say hi to the dogs and everything. Your boy misses Emmy and Riley. You know what I mean. Well, see, the only reason why I'm like I'm starting to stay here more is because, bro, I I paid for an apartment. I'm gonna stay in this apartment. You know what I mean? So, and I started getting busy with all this kind of stuff, with all the the fishies, whatever. Filter looks good, perfect. But yeah, I'm gonna try to find some more uh, things for the for the fishies. I guess more like decorations. You know what I mean? Let's hope everything goes well with the fishies. But uh, what else do I got to talk about? Oh, sorry, my bad. What else do I got to talk about? On. I'll, f I'll try to figure something out. Give me a second. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here's something I do want to talk about. For the people that are still watching this video, hello, say something in the comments because I want to name these two fishes. Name this one. So there's two kinds or there's two like specific ones that uh, you can see there's two different looking ones right there. One's like kind of like a silverish one. The other one doesn't have any like silver, like so like, English isn't my first language. <laughs> no. What I'm trying to say is that one of them has like a definitive like silver spots while the other one doesn't. It just kind of has like that that tint of silver. So what are we naming the silver one? And what are we naming to just the normal gold looking one? Any suggestions? I'm gonna feed them, see how much they want. We'll uh there we go. They're very shy, which I understand. I literally had a camera pointed at them, so that's my bad. Get up there, go eat it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Go grab some more. Yes, sir. I was gonna feed them more, but then I realized there's still some at the top. You guys gotta go grab it. By the way, I don't know if you guys saw, but for the silver one, he's got, like, red on his butt, which I'm assuming that's poop, and he just, like, can't let it out. I'm not really sure. I'm gonna let him get busy. I'm gonna let him, uh, enjoy their food and move on all right so uh, for the last part of this video we're gonna do the last part of this whole modeling stuff i just got a couple of videos a couple of videos is an understatement because a couple of videos it's actually three videos but it's always up to about an hour worth of videos so here we go <laughs> Let's have a seat, ladies and gentlemen. I got most of the modeling stuff done, so I got, uh, I just have one video left to do. And then after that, we can move on to the other, you know, the, the other stuff when it comes to modeling. Okay, rice is cooked perfectly. Let's try it. God damn. This is the 555 Caldereta, and it's spicy. Today's one of those videos where I kind of don't have like a direction. I'm just kind of going along my day and you know, seeing what happens and everything. So if you guys found this video a little bit boring, I'm sorry. Sometimes that's just the way the cookie crumbles, you know what I'm saying? I did actually want to talk about something that, that's been happening recently with my mind and stuff. And what's that thing you might ask? Uh, motivation, or lack thereof in this situation. Mars. I think about me, I go through phases a lot and stuff. Well, this is a, honestly, this video is kind of a good example of it because the title of this video is I'm addicted to Chinese buffet. After a while, I'm going to be addicted to another type of food and stuff. And it's, it's just going to keep going on a cycle. Fun fact, this isn't actually the first episode of me doing like a, I'm addicted to. I did one a couple weeks ago of rotisserie chicken. And uh, I'm just saying <laughs> the main point is that I, you know, I go through phases when it comes to anything really. Food addiction phases is such like a minuscule thing. So it's not just that, it translates to other things. Uh, like, let's say, a big example right now 
is modeling. Obviously the first few months of me doing the modeling stuff, I was like hyped about it. I'm like, oh yeah, let's get it. Let's do this. For the past like few weeks and stuff, I've been just kind of like, eh from it i'm not as motivated as i used to be when it comes to modeling and it's not modeling's fault or anything because obviously like i said i, I go through phases after giving you a few more examples I'll, I'll tell you the solution i guess but also going to the boxing gym the first few months of me going to boxing i was putting my all into it i was going in hard pause i was going to every single class i had a phase where i wasn't going as much um i think it was around like april and i started going back again like pretty often and then in the past two weeks i haven't gone i haven't gone to a class and i'm just losing motivation i guess another example is the gym since i've been going to the gym for a while now it just goes up and down so there'd be a time where i go there every single day and then i start going less and then i go back up again i'm at this phase right now where i'm like i'm, I'm not going as much i haven't gone i went yesterday but i'll get to that in just a second here before that it's been like a week since i went and even before that i was kind of like up and down a little bit i just go through phases and i lose motivation in these phases i guess what made me really want to talk about this is yesterday i went to the gym and i really just wasn't it, it just didn't feel the same like i wasn't excited for it like this whole topic i wasn't motivated for it i think i found a solution <laughs> i think i found a solution and it's gonna sound really dumb but i think it's the only way to really uh, to really keep going with everything i just have to do it no nike but i just have to do it i saw this quote somewhere and i i, I agree with it fully i don't know the exact quote but it goes along the lines of like motivation can only get you so far discipline is what gets you to that far i guess there's some other quotes too uh there's one that i'm thinking of and it basically says once you lose motivation for something that's when the real work starts and that's how you build discipline that's pretty much what i'm trying to do is i, I want to break out of this cycle and i just want to say discipline with all the stuff that i do starting this coming week i'm just gonna force myself to do it maybe this is what's keeping me from like burning out is like i actually have this like mental switch to be like hey you know slow down a little bit i still haven't failed the youtube stuff so hey man you know at least i, I got the discipline on that uh, i guess that kind of goes to show a little bit that i care about you guys more than i care about myself sorry it got a little too deep but i'm just saying i guess it's like uh, i'm afraid of you know failing you guys you know what i mean like i don't care as much if i fail myself but like if i fail you guys i'm, I'm more disappointed in that I, I don't know i feel like it should be the other way around you know because at the end of the day it's like me I'm, I'm just kind of yapping at this point but the main idea of this topic is that uh i'm losing motivation for the modeling boxing in the gym and to solve that i'm just gonna just gonna do it forcing yourself to do stuff that you don't want to do but you know you have to do it that's discipline and i want to keep building that that's the point boys yeah i don't know just kind of what's been going through my mind recently and i want to improve on a lot of stuff just so i can level myself up you know what i mean and you know in hindsight i should be doing it regardless because on top of building the discipline let's kind of strip it back a little bit me doing the regular routine stuff like the modeling boxing and the and the, the, the lifting it makes it easier for me to make videos you know what i mean it makes it easier for me to like find ideas and stuff because you know they're doing all the stuff that i should be doing it makes it easier for me to make videos that's what i'm trying to say like i said man that's just what's been on my mind recently what's been on your guys' mind recently yeah let's have a chat all right Either way. Thank you so much for watching this video. As Leafy would say, Thank you guys so much for all the support. Love you guys. Thank you guys so much for the support recently. And um, yeah. Thank y'all. See you tomorrow. Right. Turn around. No I got options. Begging me to go, but I tell her to stop it. Always got the key and my heart is the lock it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like a pro, but you're really a novice.